The workshop uh, that we've developed uh, for wraps is kind of unique. It goes over both what should be in a product security program overall, right? So what kind of supporting infrastructure should you have in your quality system to be able to produce the deliverables that need to go into your submission, right? Because the most important part is that you're generating these documents as you're developing the device, not generating these documents for a submission, right? So this should be part of the infrastructure of your product development process. And so we go over what does a good product security program look like? All of the elements, I call them pillars, right? You have a governance pillar, you have a risk management pillar. Security risk management is very distinct from regular safety risk management from 14971. You have a secure design pillar, you have a post-market pillar. All of these things are very important. If you miss any one of them, you're likely to get not only a deficiency, but a deficiency with a lot of parts to it. And trying to answer those when you haven't provided the basic information can be really challenging. And so we go over what does the product security program look like, but I think one of the unique parts of the RAPS cybersecurity and authorized program is that we also have partnered with um, key leaders from the FDA who come and talk very frankly about what do you do to prepare for a good submission. And you get the opportunity to interface with folks who've been directly related to the policy development of the guidance that we have to follow every day as regulatory professionals. So you get to hear directly from them, interpreting what they're asking for, and you get the opportunity to ask them questions. They go over the guidance documents, they go over submission preparation, pre-submission preparation, and all the things that we really want you to know to be a successful regulatory professional covering cybersecurity issues in your submission, as well as other areas of um, audits and other things where you have to defend that your security has been put in place properly.